Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank Carissa McKnight for this story. Y'all know Ron Jeremy, right? You know, the last time I did a video, I said he was the ugliest man in porn. I must have touched a nerve. I guess his um, men from his group were not happy that I said that. Well, he got heart problems. Well, when do you ever uh, take things into consideration when it's us? So now I got to consider that he got a heart problem. Oh, well, you know, he's big down there. Well, when he walks in a room, people ain't looking at that. They're looking at that ugly mug he got. <laughs> okay? Mm -mm -mm. You know, ladies and gentlemen, these are the good genes that Donald Trump was talking about. You know, I guess the worse they age, the better the genes. <laughs> I don't know. Y'all have to tell me because there's a lot of mess going on just looking at this picture. So I stand firm. He's the ugliest man in porn. So this is October 28th, 2020. And look like things are not working out so well. Now, yesterday I did see the article that said Ron Jeremy had seven more women charging him with sex crimes. And also, he had all the other charges on him. So it's seven additional women, y'all, that have come forward. That's not good. Now, this man is already up in age. And they're now talking um, 330 years behind bars. Shoot, that's a life sentence for somebody like him. He, shoot, even if you gave him 100 years, that is still a life sentence, for real. That's still a life sentence for somebody. To, that would be a life sentence even for somebody that was in their teens, 330 years. So that's what he's looking at right now. So Ron Jeremy, 330 years for him. Ron Jeremy was a teacher from Queens, New York, who became a porn star in the 70s after a girlfriend sent nude, uh, nude photos to Playgirl. 40-odd years and over 2,000 films later, he's been charged with over 30 sex assaults. Damn. And facing 330-year jail sentence. Seven new counts were filed against Jeremy this week by the Los Angeles County District Attorney's Office. Jeremy was arrested on four counts of rape and sexual assault in June this year. And since then, the charges have been piling. His attorney, Stuart Goldfob, said Jeremy is innocent. He doesn't deny being with some of these women, but it was consensual. Well, what did y'all say in the case of Bill Cosby? You said, well, look at all the women. It must be true. Looking at, look at the amount of women. So we can say the same thing when it comes down to Ron Jeremy. Look at the amount of women. Look at all the women. It must be true. Okay, since that's the measuring tool for Jen, um, Bill Cosby, we'll use that same measuring tool for Ron Jeremy. Jeremy now faces 11 counts of rape, eight counts of sexual battery by restraint, six counts of forcible oral copulation, five counts of forcible penetration by a foreign object, and one count of each of sodomy, assault with the intent to commit rape, assault with the intent to commit forcible digital penetration, penetration by a foreign object on an unconscious or sleeping victim, lewd conduct with a 15-year-old girl. Ooh, you went down to a 15-year-old girl? Mm. I don't know how you gonna get out of that. The um, incidents involved 23 victims that spanned from 1996 to 2020. 
Jeremy's bail is set at $6.6 million. Now, he sent a tweet out, and this was June of 2020 at 4.12 p.m., Los Angeles. I am innocent of all charges. I can't wait to prove my innocence in court. Thank you to everyone for all the support. So that's what he tweeted back then. Wonder if anybody cleaned that apartment. But I guess then again, if he goes to jail, he won't have to worry about that. They can get all that junk out of there and fumigate the place. Tear up all the carpets and they really need to just gut that place out. It is in horrible shape, that apartment he was in. Man, that was disgusting. But y'all, please tell me what you think. This don't look good for him, you know? And y'all notice very few of these men go to jail. Now, they did get Harvey Weinstein, but it was a lot of a lot more that really should have went to jail. But let's see what happens to Ron Jeremy here. You know, there's a lot of women coming forward. So we know that's how you measure whether it's true or not. So if they did that with Bill Cosby, we can do that with Ron Jeremy. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.